Next thing we're going to start on making is our ham and potato soup. So we're going to slice up one and a half. I'm going to set this over here. What are you doing? The ham was already sliced. Should we take the rind off or leave the rind on? Off. Oh. Doesn't matter. We're gonna take it off. You picture it. Gives it flavor. Alright. You wanna collect that all up and put it in there? Yep. All these chunks of ham? Yep. After you do that. Okay. Put them all in that cup. We need a cup and a half of ham. It goes right over here. It needs to go to right here. It's one and a half cups right there. One right here. And that's a that's one and a quarter. See, it says one and one slash two. It's one and a half. Okay. We're fill it up to there. We got about two ham. cups of ham. So and stuff. it's ham. It's ham, huh? And that's gonna go in there. So what do we need next? We need about a couple of weeks, right? Yep. So I'm gonna slide back a little bit. Right here. Put this over here. We're gonna dice up about one cup of leeks. And put it in here. No, we're gonna put it in this one. Okay. We're gonna put it in that one. So we dice up a couple of leeks right now for our ham and potato soup. And then I put it in here? Yep, you put it in there. But not when you cut it. Not while I'm cutting this. Keep your fingers back while I'm cutting, right? Alright, you gonna put that one in there? Go ahead and put those ones in there. I still have Play on the computer? Your computer. My computer. Alright, I'll put those in there. Okay. Well, I'm getting close to almost having a cup diced up. What is called again? These are called leaks. Leaks? We have leaks? Mommy, dicing up potatoes. I'm going to up. Look oh. at the recipe. Mommy, look at the recipe. <sighs> and she was dicing up potatoes. <laughs> so. And where we dump it, this in here? Well, we got to wait. Mommy's got to dice up the potatoes and all the stuff. I'm not sure what we got to do. Mommy will tell you. Do you want to grab the carrots for mommy? Yeah. All right. Go ahead and put it in a big pot. Or go ahead, I'll get this one. The onions need to go in a big pot. Carrots. Mommy, it's way back here. I think that's a pretty good couple oh, of weeks. Oh, need the big ones. Big carrots in the drawer. Which? The bottom drawer. The left one. Other one. That one. Hey, Carrie. Hey, girl. There we go. We got our leeks and our ham all diced up. Good girl. You just kind of keep turning it slowly so you can back there. Yep, yep. Peel there away go. from you. Always peel it, pushing away from you, okay? That way you don't cut yourself. Good job. You know, this has right here, this has hair and everything. 
and right here. Watch your fingers. Close your fingers up. And right here. Then pop up. two with it. Now we're going to saute this all together for a little bit. into this pot. Now we're going to add a third cup of flour. up real good. I'm going to add some garlic. We like garlic. Chicken broth. Can I put potatoes in? So, two cups of chicken broth, add it in with the potatoes. some more flavor. I don't really have a set amount. I also put some parsley in there. Just kind of go by it and taste and smell and everything. Time to add some milk. A 
a little bit and stir it in. Calls for three cups of milk. I'm going to do a, two cups of milk and a cup of heavy whipping cream just to help make it a little bit thicker. After it cooks a while, you'll want to just taste it and see how it turns out. And add some salt and pepper or any other kind of seasonings that you like. Just let it simmer down, get thickened. have it guys mama's homemade leek and potato soup and it is delicious i've tasted it thanks a lot for watching everybody we'll see you guys on the next video think it's delicious well i mean it's green green means good what do you think john green means good